Hey everyone, welcome back. Today we're going to be doing a pretty cool drawing. We are going to be drawing an artist's palette with the brush and paint and uh, kind of like a art supply kind of drawing. Should be cool. Um, so, great for all ages. Try it out, give it some color, and send me what you make. Uh, let's get started. The artist palette is the old school kind of one with the curve in it. So to make this easier, we're going to actually start with this big top curve. Kind of like that. Move this down a little bit. We're gonna have the brush through the holder, the hole too. Make it look kind of cool. Now we're going to extend this line. And then it's going to curve like this. This is the opening where you would put your hand to hold it. Or your arm goes in here and then there's a hole over here. The hole is going to be just like this. Okay. Now, it's going to overlap a little bit, so let's draw the handle first. And it's going to be like that. And then it's a little bit bigger on the top. And then see how it gets a little bit skinnier towards the bottom. And then we'll have it extend out a little bit on the bottom here. We're going to erase these lines that's overlapping because the brush is on top. And then we'll add the, the metal part and then the brush itself. We're going to give it a little bit of a curve here. Comes out and then connects. And then we can add some lines there. Now we want to give this some thickness to this palette. So we're going to add a line there. We're going to add a line that comes across the bottom here. Try to erase that little extra too. Sometimes that happens. When you overlap, you gotta erase what's behind it. And then we also have a curve here. Just to give this palette a little bit more 3D effect. All right. Now we're going to give it some, the colors uh, across the top here. Just make kind of just uneven blobs of paint. Put three up here, and then three on this side. And these are what we'll add color to later. Cool, right? Then we're going to make a cool swirl that gets painting. We're just going to come here and then curve around. So it's down, up, and around. And then we're going to just kind of keep sketching in more lines because we're going to make this kind of rainbowy. Kind of like that. That looks cool, right? So not too many steps, not too hard. But now we can give it some color too. So. What I'll do is I'll do my color here. And then go over here and use that same color to fill it in. And even add another little blob there. Orange next. 
It doesn't have to be this order. Be creative, be different. Let's add a few more blobs there. I like that. Yellow. Can't believe the school year is almost done, too. A few more days. Hopefully, you've been having a little fun with my videos. Always good to do art whenever you can. Good for your mind. There's my blue. Violet or purple. Nice, right? Cool. Now, handle would be brown. Or black. There's all sorts of different types of brushes. And bristles, whoops, that didn't work. Bristles would be black. Now if I had more time, I'd probably outline uh, the palette too with marker. I think that would look pretty cool. But running low on time here. You know, you can always outline this, make it pop really good. So I hope you liked it. It's pretty fun. Give it a try. Thanks for watching. Send me your photos. And I'll see you next time with Drawing Mr. Maine with Mr. Maine. Take care.